In the next five years, Rockford could look a whole lot different. It starts with two reconstruction projects in the works, one at the West State Street corridor and the other near North Main Street in the city's downtown. 13 News' Cassandra Bretto explains what you need to know. Cassandra. Brittany, another wave of reconstruction on West State Street means drivers will need to find an alternative route starting on Monday, but for good reason, as two lanes will transform into four lanes. It's just the tip of the iceberg, according to Rockford's Director of Public Works, but business owners say they waited long enough for change. The second phase in revitalizing West State Street is about to begin. This time, the focus is from South Day Avenue to South Independence Avenue. Continue with everything that we, uh, you know, benefited from in Phase One. So, you know, expanding that roadway to a, a four-lane um, section with a really nice landscaped median, um, you know, decorative lighting um, enhancements. Um, as well as uh, accommodating both bike and, and pedestrians along the corridor as well. It can only help everybody in the long run. Saunders says the roughly $20 million phase two project includes moving electricity off the street and improving stormwater systems. He says Rockford has seen an increase in pedestrian and bike paths, and this project aligns with the city's future. Whether it be biking, walking, or using you know public transit, um, if those facilities there and they're comfortable, um, I think it's fair to say that people are going to choose to use those. Not only will this project help with safety, but Saunders hopes once it comes to fruition, revitalization, business, and residential development will follow. Although Doc Slavowski, a downtown business owner, says while it'll welcome the west side into downtown, he's got another project on his mind, one he's waited for for more than 30 years. If you can make Main Street a two-way through the entire city, and go from Clem Arboretum all the way up to Sports Corps and everything in between. But they're disconnected because of this sort of one-way conundrum. Slavowski says businesses will thrive and tourism will boost when Main Street and Church Street turn into two ways. But he says all city projects are important. And Saunders says the city has completed its intersection design studies on Main Street and Church Street and hope to start construction in 2023. For 13 News, I'm Cassandra Brettel.